behind the mask and vacant smile, and the ogre spewing vicious bile, the rising voice and flailing fist of the pacifist turned pugilist. It's me. Still me. Behind the tear-flecked downcast eyes, where puzzlement and panic lies, filled with searching, who's and why's, eyes that question, scowl and glare, or hold a dreamy distant stare. It's me. It's still me. Underneath the coat of snide remarks, arguments and flying sparks, muddlement, puzzlement, and baffled befuddlement, exasperation, sheer frustration, and seemingly meaningless conversations, the swift explosive violence, and lasting sullen silence. It's me. It's still me. Or what's left of me. Deep inside the brittle shell of the person playing Mary Hell, the cantankerous surly so-and-so with emotions veering to and fro is the man who not so long ago was warm and easygoing, carefree and full of fun, giving freely of himself to each and every one. Remember me? Beneath the childlike chuckles and the away with the fairy's air and the penchant for stripping off and wandering everywhere with mood swings through from cheerful to total and utter despair. From compliant and amicable to absolute nightmare. It's me. It's still me. Or at least the remnants of me. So reach beneath the outer sheath for the person hidden underneath the drooling and the flatulence the insolence, intolerance, and barefaced naked truculence, out and out malevolence, and in your face belligerence, the childish bouts of petulance, and the telltale stains of incontinence, for the man who used to shine so bright, sing by day and dance by night, be confident and yet polite, affable and erudite, reduced now to this sorry sight, cowering in abject fright, or lashing out in spitting spite. I'm there, still shining, though nowhere near as brightly. Just take the time to look and see what lies within this broken me, this fragmented merely token me, bereft of pride and dignity the inside man, the absentee, the person that before was me, is there somewhere.